Hey, what's going on guys? It's me Aiden. Welcome back to Miraculous Monday. Don't have any announcements other than we did not hit a bingo last week, so that's great news. Here's the bingo card for this week, in case we hit one. Then I will have to wear the horns next week. Yay, at least it's not the wig. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna hop right into this video. I ain't gonna ask this question. I'm a Miraculous Ladybug fan, or really name one character. Ladybug. That's on me, I set the bar too low. Yeah, well, even the full name is Miraculous Ladybug and Cat Noir. Wait, uh. Tales of Ladybug and Cat Noir. Miraculous Ladybug, Tales of Ladybug and Cat Noir. So, like, just in the name alone, at least that's like the English name. It's weird. In different countries and different areas of the world, they call it different things. Like, we call it Miraculous Ladybug. Other people in the world just call it Miraculous. So, it's really interesting. Um, but yeah, in the full name, at least in the US, it's. Ladybug and Cat Noir. So you, you've got to at least either specify Ladybug and Cat Noir not included or or just say three characters and then you're set. But yeah, so there's a fun fact for you. For those of you who didn't know, you know, out in the other world, it's called something different. Oh, Natalie of the Pool, what is your wisdom? Day three. Oh, Natalie of the Pool, what is your wisdom? Your son, he is Cat Noir. I see, I see. Well then, I'll traumatize him, beat him with my cane, and give him infinite power. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, Hawkmoth, that's definitely a good idea. Definitely something that you should be doing to your son. Yeah, th th thank you, Hawkmoth. This is why we all hate you now. <laughs> Meme. I'm so tired I couldn't sleep last night. Did you know that if you can't sleep it's because someone's thinking about you? Who is thinking about me at 2 a.m.? Panics. Okay. That's not true. People all around the world are gonna be thinking of Ladybug, right? Because, you know, surely she's not just like in Paris or known in Paris, right? Surely she's like a like a whole world phenomenon, just like the superheroes in New York, right? So surely she's gonna be having coverage from other parts of the world where 2 a.m. in Paris might not be 2 a.m. In, in a different part of the world where they're thinking about Ladybug. Like, oh, maybe they're watching a video. So that just doesn't make sense, guys. You know, because because people, could be thinking and I don't know but yeah I don't think it, it would be limited to Cat Noir you know it's like y you're having parallel thoughts across multiple people you know it's not just Cat Noir who's thinking about you at that specific time because Ladybug is sort of a celebrity at this point a literal doorman hey speaking of New York City hero doorman in New York City the doorman in Mayor Bourgeois fancy hotel yeah, I know, they just use the same model. Relax, guys. Sometimes they have to cut corners where they can. And they thought that they could cut corners here. And so they did. So, just, just, you know, it's fine, guys. Just, just let them be. They have to save a little bit of money somewhere. <laughs> Why? Translate Cat Noir into Black Cat or just keep Cat Noir. Cat Noir. Yeah. Well, I think they re- I'm sure they tried it. And they were like, hmm, black cat, that just does not fit. So we're going to keep Cat Noir. And a good choice that they made. Cat Noir definitely sounds better. Marinette, you're a ladybug in watercolor. Oh, we've seen a lot of watercolors. Ah, uh, this is very cool. Throwback to the origins with the cup. And ah, uh, man, this is really cool. I always love the watercolor things. It's such a cool way to see a different interpretation on a character. Albeit, this one's not too different. But, I mean, like, is there more detail in the pants? Maybe? I don't know. But typically, when we've seen the watercolor version, we've seen, like, different, like, like a, a different design for the heroes, which I've always enjoyed seeing. To all my Cat Noir simps, the world is a cruel and unjust place. There is no harmony in the universe. The only constant is suffering. Minutes later, all they see Cat Noir. Uh, except wasn't this originally an Adrian thing? So someone had to Photoshop this in. This wasn't usually a Cat Noir. <laughs> So, that's, that's a little sad, probably. Sad truth there. This is not originally a Cat Noir. I don't think, right? I'm pretty sure this was Adrian. Like, cause isn't this Marinette's wallpaper or something? I, I don't know. That's what I thought it was. I'm pretty sure. I, I, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's wrong. But I'm pretty sure someone made this different. This, this, was, this was an Adrian thing, so. I don't know. Do with that information what you will. Apparently, it is normal for French parents to eat their kids, so I guess Gabriel is innocent. School bans parents from throwing their children over its six feet fence when they're running late? Uh, I think this is probably different. I don't think this exempts Gabriel from what he did, but 
I mean... Okay, I guess... I mean, but they, they banned it, so technically they're saying it's not normal, so we're, we're putting a ban on it, so... I don't know, plus this was only six feet, this was like... I don't know how many feet, but a lot more than six, so yeah, I don't think it's the same. <laughs> nice try, though. Amazing! Lady Noir in the Shanghai Special! They eat ice cream together, her smile when she sees a message from Cat Noir, their expressions change from serious to adorable when they look at each other. Just look at them. She immediately hugs him after the fight. The awkward yet cute smiles on their faces when they say goodbye. Yeah. But then they forget about it as soon as they leave. The sad, unfortunate truth. Because the specials, even though they're said to have connection with the main story, they never bring it back up. And it's a little sad, because it's cool. And plus, this happened between season 2 and 3, so that was a little bit weird with the timeline, so... Yeah, we just, we just say that specials are their own thing. Which is a bit unfortunate, but that's just the way it is. Oh, Natalie of the Pool, what is your wisdom? Day 6! So I guess there were a lot of these then. Oh, Natalie of the Pool, what is your wisdom? Saying children should not be neglected or abandoned is hypocritical. I feel you're onto something, but I can't quite put my finger on it. Okay, well this was said in the bubbler, right? I mean, I guess he was neglecting Adrian for a while, but like, still. This was at the very early stages. Or wait, was that the bubbler? I don't know. What episode was this? Let me know down in the comments. I don't remember what episode he said this in. I'm sure you guys know. Let me know. Happy Father's Day to the only real father figure that Adrian has. Ah, oh, we've got the gorilla. Yeah. We don't have an official name for him yet, do we? <laughs> so we, we just call him the gorilla. Ah, oh, nice gorilla, man. He should do this to Adrian, though. And Adrian's so small. I, I, okay, I guess this is in, like, an alternate universe. Or uh, maybe, he is the, maybe he's been the bodyguard forever. Interesting. I don't know. That's interesting. I, I want to know more about the Gorilla Man. Like, maybe we'll see that out. See that out. Maybe we'll figure that out in Gabriel Agrest. I don't know. A miraculous fusion that shouldn't exist. Peacock and Ladybug. Oh boy, this is... This is an interesting one. They definitely go with Peabug over the other one. <laughs> nice try. But I, are we ever going to see that fusion? Maybe not. Maybe we won't ever have to deal with that. Interesting. I guess it depends on... If they ever win, and if they do win, do they capture the Miraculous? Hmm, interesting thoughts. Let's be honest, all our hearts crumbled when our boy Adrian cried. He's been through so much. When Marinette cried, this is so sad. When Adrian cried, heart breaks. You know, speaking of Adrian crying, guess what? In the manga, because actually they released a little volume where it's like only the Miraculous manga, right? So they released that, so I got it, right? So I was looking through it. And there's a scene in, I think, I don't remember which episode specifically, but the manga is essentially just taking episodes and putting them into a manga form, right? So they've done the bubbler, they've done stormy weather, and that may have been it so far. I think Stor or the bubbler was split into two parts. Anyway, point is, Adrian, we had a scene of Adrian crying in there. I was like, bro, what the heck? We didn't get this in, in the show. I was like, this gives us way better storytelling for Adrian. Why, why didn't we see this, bro? And so, I thought that was really nice. I mean, obviously it's sad, but like, you know, it, it's good to see more of Adrian and his development and his feelings on the inside, which we don't see too often in the show. So I thought that was really cool. Okay, Noir delivered a hidden message in Silencer during the Lucky Charm scene. So cute. I love you, oh my goodness. Thank you, Ladybug. That's very, very nice of her. Ladybug? That wasn't Ladybug. Cat Noir. Thank you, Cat Noir, is what Ladybug should be saying. Yeah, okay. Well, I kind of butchered that, but we're just going to roll with it. <laughs> anyway, Cat Noir, uh, good job. You have conveyed your feelings once again. Although, uh, did, did Ladybug... I don't remember this scene. Did Ladybug remember this? Hmm, I don't remember. Or did she like realize what he was doing? I don't remember the, the context of this, so I'd have to go back and rewatch it. My little heart can't take this anymore. Man, this week is just Adrian Appreciation Week, isn't it? 
Adrian doesn't deserve this. He was 14 years alone. He lost his mother. His father is Hawkmon. Ladybug rejected him all this time. Kagami broke up with him. He lost only his only childhood friend. This is not much of a loss. <laughs> and he smiles. And he still smiles. Smiles no matter what. Yeah. And he still smiles no matter what. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Uh, okay, we don't exactly know the timeline. Like, like, didn't... I... When... I think this was like a year or two ago, right? This was... This wasn't too long ago. I don't think. So... I don't know. We need to know more about their family timeline. Because a lot of this, like, as far as the timeline goes, and how Adrian was treated back before this event, we don't know how all that was. So hopefully Gabriel Agrest will actually clear all that up. But it may not, so I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see, I guess. But I'm sure we'll learn eventually. But until we do, we don't exactly know the timeline and all the events like this. Wow, Pigeon Man again. How are we ever going to survive this catastrophe? Mr. Ramier stubs his toe. Hawk Moth ready to akumatize him again. It's showtime. Yeah. Thanks, Hawk Moth, for akumatizing the same person. I've said this before, but you'd think after 72 times, you'd realize, hmm, maybe this isn't working out. But oh well, it's Hawk Moth. So true. Hey, look at that. The Instagram posts. I haven't seen these in a while. If Adrian, sick, Cat Noir is a little sick, and then Marinette gets sick because she was hanging out with Cat Noir. We get more continuity from the characters' Instagrams than the actual show. Actually, this season's been pretty good about that. We've seen a lot of continuity, and uh, it, it feels good. Because it, it feels like each episode builds on itself. And it's so good. Like, for example, in Optigami, right, Hawkmoth learns that Ollie is not just another Miraculous holder. And then in the next episode, uh, Senti Bubbler, he actually goes and blackmails Ollie. Like, that's great. He's, oh man, continuity. I love it. A really good parallel between truth and lies. So you're saying you like it when I clown around? Yes, and I couldn't do without it today. No, that's not really you. That's when you act like a clown. And maybe when I'm a clown, that's really me. Dang. Maybe Adrian doesn't want to go back. He has realized his error in his ways. Kagami is not the one. Maybe. Some of us do be like Master Fu, though. When someone says I'm too old to watch Miraculous, I'm still young. I'm only 186. I love this scene. Master Fu, you're a good guy. Although, I, I, I st after you lost your memories and you forgot how to do your rituals of, like, I don't know, staying alive, I don't know how you're still this old. It's, um, it, it's a miracle, I guess. So, I don't know, good luck to you, but you probably won't last too much longer. I mean, if we were being realistic, but, you know, they're not gonna just kill him off. He's gonna be around for a while, probably. What if, what if it was like this from the start? Time Traveler moves a chair, current timeline, miraculous, Tales of Mr. Bug and Lady Noir. Hmm, that'd be interesting. I don't know, the whole idea of miraculous is like women's empowerment, right? So, that it would I think it would completely change the narrative, because that's just not, like, it, it's all about female empowerment. And so, if, by having, I mean, assuming that the ladybug character stayed the same role that would completely change the um the message i guess of the show so i yeah i don't know that i guess that would mean maybe a completely different show maybe not who knows but yeah it would be that would be interesting i would be interested to see what that would look like but anyway guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy, you can leave a like and subscribe for more content similar to this. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh, Natalie of the pool, what is your wisdom? Saving children should not be neglected. Wait. Oh, saying children. Okay. Oh, Natalie of the pool, what is your wisdom? Saying children. Yeah, say it's saying. It's saying. Happy Father's Day to the real only. Yeah. So you're saying that you like it when I clown around? Yes, and I couldn't do it without it, and I couldn't, yeah. 
You're saying you like it when I clown around? Yes, and I couldn't do it without it to... Oh my goodness. Time travel... 